Our next step is to build a thread dam in front of the lead wire wraps, then move it behind the lead wire wraps with another thread dam so the lead wire wraps stay exactly where we want them on the hook shank. Now we're going to move the thread using the bobbin to the end of the hook shank where we're going to mount the tail. We're going to tie in a tail using a tuft of pine squirrel hide as the tail. We take our pine squirrel hide and we're going to fold it like this while we hold in our fingers a little tuft of material, cut it off at the skin line. We're going to tie in the tail like this. I'm holding it by the butt ends. Now I'm transferring it to my left hand to hold it by the tip ends. I remove the under fur from the guard hairs. I hold it on top of the hook shank. I bring the thread up into my fingers, called the magic pinch, and when I pull the thread, thread down, the tail is locked in, and I continue to wrap it toward the rear of the hook shank, so I always finish at the rear of the hook shank. Then I'm going to take my scissors, and I'm going to lift up the waste material and snip it out. So now we have the tail on our trout fly. We have the fly is weighted with the lead wraps, and we're ready to go to the next step.